selecting elements using the element ID. Every single element in the project is identified with an ID number. So it's like it's a so unique social security number for every element. Uh, Revit uses these ID numbers to generate error codes. They'll tell you what item is having a problem. So to figure out what the ID number is for a particular element, you just go and you modify and you select a particular element. You go up to the Manage tab and up in Inquiry here you have IDs of selection. It gives you the ID number. Okay, it's 184342. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to do Control C and I'm going to copy that and say OK. And now I'm going to hit Escape. Now, I can go in and find a particular error code. If I'm given an error code, I can go up to Inquiry under the Manage tab. I can go to Inquiry and I can type in that number. In this case, I'll just Control V and paste that in and I'll say Show. And it shows me that particular uh, uh, element for that ID number. All right. So in this case, I say OK, and it brings me right to that where I can manipulate that particular element.